Uh, just having more fun with cars. Doesn't seem to be any end to it these days. Anyways, uh, this uh, nice expensive uh, $200 plus uh, electric uh, cooling fan uh, controller here on my car bit the dust so that uh, I have a choice. Either the fans, uh, either I unplug them or uh, they run um, full blast both of them as soon as you uh, get in and turn the key of the car. You don't even have to turn it on and run the engine. So anyway, something something major in there died. I even tried a wrecking yard one. And it had a different problem. But anyways, long story short, Sun and I decided to uh, rectify the problem with about a uh, $30 uh, part from some other Jags. It's a, uh, I don't know, this one looks like it's 200 degrees off on 180 off uh, temperature sensor there. And you can see it there. It screws into a uh, pipe fitting, regular pipe thread. Uh, so my son made up this uh, adapter here, I guess you'd call it, out of uh, a piece of uh, steel pipe and welded uh, on each end there. Uh, a little uh, nub there so that the pipe will grip it. And uh, so then we, we slit the regular uh, rad hose and took a piece of it out and uh, then hose clamped it in there. And have to attach a ground wire to it there, get down the bottom. So then basically your uh, your wire here attaches to, uh, oh, got the wire here, you have to hook a relay in and uh, get it back to uh, uh, ignition switched power source. But uh, So basically it replaces this uh, complicated expensive fan controller. I'm not saying it's as good, um, but uh, at least I won't burn my engine up now. I had uh, rigged up uh, two... Uh, toggle switches uh, right by the steering column that worked for a while but if somebody forgets to other than me that's driving and or whatever forgets to turn them on then you can bake your engine just overheat it so anyways just kind of a, uh, a simple uh, inexpensive way to uh, replace an expensive uh, electric uh, cooling fan controller for your car there uh, give you an idea uh, you know you there's some work involved welding etc but and figuring out where to where to put it in the hose and all that. But uh, if you have a semi rare car that you can't find uh, parts for, or it's very expensive. This is a uh, cheaper uh, alternative to uh, an expensive part. Anyway, just wanted to uh, give you that idea. The other thing I found out on this is that uh, sometimes a 12 point uh, metric or standard socket will uh, work on a uh, Torx head uh, bolt on some of the air conditioning fittings, uh, bolts holding them in. Anyway, uh, just uh, wanted to give you that little tip there, so we'll catch you later.